at the tail of the table. The challenger fighting out of Miami by way of Colombia, Juan Ura. Seven max and just wasn't able to welterweight time. So some of his bucks like got hurt in round number one against Colazzo. But what he was able to do in this fight was use his athleticism, but more importantly, he used his heart. Yeah, there were times in this fight like it looked like Berto might not make it to the end, like Colazzo might not make it to the end. They both made it to the end, but in that 12th and final round, when it looked like the fight could be in the balance, Berto really fought like a champ, took over the round really with willpower, and that's the kind of thing, no matter how fast the guy is, how good he looks, how flashy he looks at times, that's perfect tonight and keep it. wins coming by way of knockout. Please welcome the IBF Junior Welterweight Champion of the World. This is 19. Please welcome the undefeated WBC Welterweight Champion of the World. Good luck, fellas. One of 12 children served in To create some punch in your speed is very apparent. Berto's as fast as they come. His advantage is to their fullest. That snuck through. His right against the southpaw Urango. It's, it's because he's so fast that it doesn't. Both ways. And I was boxing him. Imagine. Watch out because, you know, his, his head's pretty. As Urango's just. to him. Right, he needs to concentrate on that. Fairly good rhythm. Well, he wants to win this fight. Even if Urango tries anything, he can run in to Berto because, you know, something he has to lift up and wait here, but Berto's not a big one. Just see it in his back. Part of his strategy. Urango gets knocked down, but it's ruled a slipper. get Urango to commit and then score. I mean... Right Angled legs or... Oh! Well, you Harold Letterman, how do you have it? Crazy. And when Urango, he's got two hands free to tell the referee... The winning of the towel Split second. And that way they won't call it on you. Actually, speed and reforms. At in this point, in the, in the clinches... Slip out, turn them. They both land big shots. In the hole, Urango can be hitting, hitting him at the stage. Berto's the better fighter. Why stop the action? Berto aren't totally right. The holidays, they look to hold, get caught with a pump. Berto throws a good right hand there. Should come back with a... Berto in a fight that he's shutting out Urango in. It's judged against the best in the sport. Trying to stay away from you. Rango's trying to move his hands, and Berto tags. <laughs> Victory against previously under. Good right hand by Berto. All the time, and that's. The referee doesn't have to come in and warn him. Those style kind of. Downs in the fight. 140, trying to take Rango be doing more of. And he's trying to measure when he comes because he can't catch him right now. And that's what he... See there, Berto is holding. They're a strong, determined fighter. And that says something. Oh, pitching a shot so far. That's when he stops and then he can throw combinations. They move out on one. Right hand for Berto. Got all the talent. And you will see Berto throwing a good right hand. Catching Urango. Urango coming back. 
Physical gifts. Is Berto creating demand with the likes of Miguel Cotto, the welterweight division, the, the superstars like Mark? I tell you, he's landing all of and Urango does not point down. Look at that left jab that on backhand with that left jab. He makes the nothing Berto. Throws a quasi legal jab. Have a lot of strength because he's strong. He's very muscular. But Berto seems to be the strong. Berto does there as he to catch him with a couple clean shots. <laughs> Moves around, uses his hand. Similar re <laughs> Berto is given gate. This movement of Berto and this hand speed. He's close so he can't hit him. And even this, what he's doing, Berto backs him up against the wall. Well, you know. The jab there by Berto. And Urango's got and he's checking over to the other side. So in his movement. And hit. Well, Urango according to CompuBot. Berto's really done is circle the when they're pitching. But that creates to bring out different including to the, the business marketing act. Well, you have to, it, it's your Azo fight, but the least is just how clear it is at this moment. Where's Kim and Scarves? I would have taken it. That's all there is to it. He can't chase it. If he warns him for holding. I, you know, I, I would have to. If he can do, he's shown it. Like that. Jab. On the ropes and towards the corner. Guy's a good inside fighter. You're less than ideal. Well, you know, it's getting caught with a... With it, with See, the ref should step in, punching. That's when the ref shot of hitting Bird. Very different to change the course we were watching. Guys, for going away. It's a tough standard. He's a very, very promising fighter. Glue his first career loss here. Andre Berto dominating. Well, you know, he doesn't have a loss. He's 24 0. He's on his way to 25 0, barring it's something. That's what I'm trying to not happen here at all tonight. From his last fight on that. Hope is that he could be Sugar Ray Leonard and career. Mm -hmm. ah. Max is calling you out for something. Do I? Berto, you know, you Urango's must wants to do. That he has to. These fights are fought not on paper but in the ring. What what everyone expects all of the rounds. But I don't know if it's Pacquiao good. Because that's the top of the welterweight division. According to Bird, or the money fight next, they're hoping for it. It's a lot of star and firepower there. Yes. Another good fighter, unless that fighter's worth a lot of money to them. One, maybe all 12 rounds. <laughs> In this fight, Berto did a great job, and Urango, you see.